Thanks for joining us today on the Zelda Lady featuring that guy. We're going to continue our walkthrough of Breath of the Wild. Thanks for joining us. And today we're going to go into real estate. So we're going to, we are in Hatino Village. And in this little house on the side of the, back behind the shrine, kind of. And there's some gentlemen, there's a gentleman over here. Hi. Oh, hello yeah. there. Another day, another rupee. What are you doing? Well, he's working, as you can see. This old house has been abandoned. Everyone in Hatino Village agree that we should demolish it. The old owner apparently went off to the castle to report for service, and he never came back, never wrote, and so away it goes. Yeah, I'll teach him. Yeah. I was like, I'll buy this place. Well, I'm not into real estate, so I can't help you there. If you're really interested, you need to go talk to the boss. He's behind the house. <clears throat> hey, big bossy. Hey, hey, and his name is Bolson. Mm -hmm. Okay. What are you I doing? How old he is. He does have gray hair. Uh -huh. He probably is older. But I don't know. He know he is the boss. Hi, I'll Rose. buy it. Okay. Uh oh. Load of um, Mr. Moneybags wants to buy it, huh? He looks speculative. Uh, hmm. You're gonna buy it. The price hmm. just went up. <laughs> Okey do. Okay, it's been it. vacant for years. And now they're gonna tear it down. Fifty thousand rupees. What? So hmm. when you're ready to buy it, how much do you have? Oh no, I'll pay. Who would have thought? Little go getter, aren't you? Yep. Hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. Look. Here's the deal, just for you. Ooh. Oh, he's gonna cut the price to three thousand rupees. Right off the bat. But in return, we Don't need to bring 30 wood bundles. Oh. Okay. Okay. So, He's got to bring the wood. And. Hi. And. Who's that guy? Oh, that's um, his, other, his other worker. Yeah, he's got two workers. Okay. So, so now, what did he say? 3,000 rupees. And, and 30 bring, bring pieces of wood. wood. And let's see. Let's look at our inventory. Inventory. We have four pieces of wood and mm. only 1,500 rupees. Let's get to so chopping. We, let's got to get to chopping. You're right. So there's a couple things we could do. I suggest that we just immediately start to go over to where stables are because mm -hmm. more than likely there are wood bundles by the stables oh. that we can just pick up without a problem that's cool do a little teleporting mm -hmm. so let's do some bit bop booping around the map bop and Lula. <laughs> she's my baby she's okay. my baby oh and this is what part of the run through of breath of the wild looks like part of the time you have to um gather resources to to achieve the next level, to open mm -hmm. up the next part of the story. Um, and so right now, we're after wood and rupees. Mm -hmm. Here's the lakeside staple. And on here. Oh, rude, they don't have any wood. Is that a oh, shield? I don't think we need a shield. Oh, we grabbed it. The dog running in circles. I can't believe they don't have any wood. Okay. Maybe we are going to have to go make our own wood. It's raining. Who wants to go out and work in the rain? No one. As a matter of fact, some of the sellers that are like traveling uh -huh. salespeople. Don't trust them. 
peddlers, traveling peddlers or whatever they are. Traveling. Their prices change in the rain to cheaper. To cheaper, right? They do. There's a lot of supply and demand. <laughs> There's a supply deal. and demand going on in Breath of the Wild as well. I think we just had a blood moon recently. And we can do a two for one situation. Let's see if the hardy durians are growing back. That's the last time I harvested, and no. I will still go ahead and... Give it a whack? Uh, yeah. Yeah, we'll... it. yeah that was... You're strong. For the wood. But only one piece of wood. Man, the only thing is, they ain't gonna have no trees in their town. What the time you get to do? Well, it regenerates. The trees regenerate. I know. You're just blowing them up. You're terrible. You're the one slur. <laughs> uh, and, and no way to be confused with Ricky Bobby. Truffler trees or toast. Trees. Oh, yeah, maybe those aren't the best trees to blow up. Truffler fruit. But we want those hardy durians yeah, anytime we can get them. Handy when you're fighting. Yep. Off, cam look, off camera, they, I, I harvested a bunch and made some meals. They look like pineapples to me. Um, yeah. No. Like they're sweet like a passion fruit. Oh, okay. yeah, they do give that appearance. You know, this isn't the best forest for this kind of tree. You know what it is good what is... What about the uh, poor animals? Where are they going to live if you take all the trees? They'll be all right. The Ferna Woods are a little better. Unless I have a... Now that I've been... You're going to run into the Lorax. <laughs> yeah, I have a really good forestation um, method. You plant two every time you tell one? <laughs> No, I'll let me rephrase that. I have a really good deforestation oh. method <laughs> because it regenerates. It's a game. It's not real. Okay, you're making me feel really guilty right now. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, <laughs> I'm really sorry. I was just joking. I know. <laughs> good, you okay. have a conscience. I do. I totally do. Now don't let that happen again. <laughs> Stay in. Okay, so. Here's my oh, you know what? What? So if I follow the tree that way, mm -hmm. and I follow the tree this way, then I can combine the inside bomb. So there, I got three bombs and three pieces of wood. Yeah. Instead of three bombs on one piece of tree, mm -hmm. I would just get one wood. Like this <laughs> one. <laughs> that sounds a, a weird thing to say, but. Okay, okay. so I'm gonna tip that one that way. Uh oh, here come the crackheads. Okay. You better run. I'm, I'm gonna just knock the tree on him. Hey, brother. Hey, hey, man. Hey, <laughs> you. Hey. Stop Can it. Can I talk to you for a minute? Uh, oh, I think <laughs> I bombed myself. Oh, oh my gosh. Well, that gave you some space at least. I don't have a weapon. Okay. Oh, you got the Majora's mask on. That's why they're talking to you. Hey, get off. Got it. Oh, yeah, that is why they're talking to me. Uh huh. But they're were... going to pick up their own heads. Yeah, it's I thought you were cool, dude. You have to like... <laughs> <laughs> I got to find my head. Okay. So there's now... Okay, back to what we were actually doing. Oh, they're both following them, huh? Yeah, if you don't kill their heads after you knock their heads off, then they pick their heads back up. No, those bones, he was walking away and his arm was chasing him. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they do all that. Um, wow. Didn't they great break dancers? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so I'm making some progress on wood. Okay. What is that thing? Oh, some guy. Oh, there we go. Oh, there. he's mean. Is he? What is he? A goblin? Yeah. He's got like a person down. Oh. All scared. Oh, man. And then they, they recover, and sometimes they talk to you, and sometimes they give you money or a uh, elixir or uh, something. Aha! Heavens, that was a narrow escape. Uh. 
nothing. We're looking ah. for Silent Princess. Oh. What? Alright. No time for you. more damage here with the bombs. And it's all um, so that we can complete that side quest and buy our house. I think we're going to have a housewarming party. <laughs> we totally should. Yeah. And maybe a fight an interior decorator. Four, and I still have that right there. Yeah. I wonder how, how we're doing. Are, we need thirty. We need thirty. How many have we got so far? Um, one take the inventory. We have nineteen. Yeah. See, it's, yeah. this is a quick way to get it. Yeah, but there will be no shade for it. You know what? <laughs> you're like, what happened to the runoff? and silt in the bomb. Peter, Paul, and Mary are in the corner singing. How many blowing in the wind? Yeah, <laughs> The <laughs> with one tear. Now we don't have a seat. With, with one tear coming down our face. Yeah. <laughs> Indigenous people run off. <laughs> I right, stop it. Okay. Oh, blood. Okay. It's like really bad. Really bad. Uh huh. Mother nature karma right now. Uh huh. You're making me feel horrible. But I'm not stopping. Do not stop. Don't stop. <laughs> don't you dare stop. <laughs> stop it some more. Okay. Oops! Don't change. And you know what? In like an hour, we'll come Don't back. Don't go change. This, this forest will be just right back the way it was. <laughs> I promise you. We'll come right back. That's because of the fertilizers they're using. <laughs> right. I don't even want to talk about the chemicals. <sighs> you know, it's going to be a little far from the villain, but it's okay. You've got horns going out of their heads. We got, we got two. Ooh, that did do it. Okay, so we're going to knock down this one. We should be getting close. Look, there's another little issue we have to attend to. What? We don't have enough money. Well. I know how you can make some money. I know, with the gems. Turning them in at the store. Right. Okay. There's other side quests where you can make money, too. How? Um, like... You, you talk to the people in the towns, they go, oh no, I need 20 crickets, or, or something, <laughs> like whatever their issue is, and you help them, and there, there will usually a monetary reward involved when you get done with your side quest. I know, I'm going to see some Dark Ricans when I need some money. Um, you know what? We still have to, you know, you know what? We have one that we've completed the side quest, and when we completed the side quest, it was three in the morning, uh -huh. and the, um, oh, the guy yeah. wasn't there. It was when he, we gathered the chickens. If we go right. back and talk to him, our quest is done, and yeah. I think that's 50 rupees. Think he'll give us a cluck? Yes, he will. For a buck? Either, I can't remember what the reward is, but we, we should go do that really quick. Yeah, we should. All right, let's check our wood inventory. That guy liked That this. was a good little pile of wood. Let's see what we got with that. Um, rude. Just two, and this one is hopefully two. Uh-huh. Oops. It is two. Oh, it was three. That was <laughs> really cool. Wow, we have 38. So we're in good shape for wood, but we need 1,500 more rupees. So let's go ahead and pop over to, here we go, bit popping around the map, going over to Kakarika Village. Where I call home on Hyrule for some reason. Yeah, because. I don't a, know why. Because It's a wonderful environment. And it puts you well, at ease. I really think it's because Kakariko Village in Twilight Princess was so cool too, mm -hmm. and you have a good feeling. About um, it. yeah, and I have this whole theory about Kakariko Village, and if you have so ever played Twilight Princess, I should make a whole video about my theory on this. But it, there, it looks the same, and if cons conspiracy theorists were listen to me. I think there's a place where they could do another DLC out of Kakariko Village. Um, hashtag, remember the little secret hidden lake behind the mountain? Yeah, check it out. Yeah, that's Look, the property It, it you still exists. Buy. That same spot exists location, still. Location, location, yes, location. Yes, anyway, just saying. Yeah, I hashtag like just saying. A bungalow on the lake. Okay, and we were going to Kakariko Village to... Bye. 
Oh, so talk to, to the Palm Springs. To, oh, and here we are. Here we, we're three in the dang morning again. Oh. Okay. Really and all the chickens. Let's see. Let's see. They should have ten chickens in here. Count them up. Um, count them up. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Yeah. That's you you can't attend that fast. Mm -hmm. There's five on that side. But okay, you're right. All right. So it's not raining. I'm thank goodness. On all cylinders. So we're gonna go over here, and we're gonna sit by the fire and make it noon because we yeah. can manipulate time and space on this game. Well, manipulation is good. <laughs> all right. So when we wake up, hope it's not raining. It's so irritating when it rains in this game. Yay! It's nice. Okay. And there he is. This might be some quick money. Ha 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 ha. Yeah, we love that too. All right, Kato. Kato? Kato. Link! My cuckoos! My sweet baby cuckoos. They're all back. Thank you so much. 50. We'll take it. But we need faster money than that. So, you know what? We're gonna go sell some stuff. I know we have some stuff we can sell. And now's the time. There's a hotel, but don't pay for a hotel when you can sit by the fire for free. I and know. I like this There's little- There's a certain amount of ambiance in the hotel that you just don't get from the fire. <laughs> I think for the money, it leaves you in a better head space. <laughs> it's the little quinta com uh, theory, huh? <laughs> Well, you know. Okay, this little old lady in here. Oops. I don't want her recommendations. I wanted to sell something to her. Uh, well, everything I sell, really. The swift carrots and the fortified pumpkins. Yeah. That's Kakarito, Kakariko's uh, crops. Fortified pumpkins fortified and the swift. Pumpkins got and a the kick. swift. <laughs> those fortified pumpkins do have a kick. Yes, we want to sell. Okay. We've been, we've been gathering some pretty good uh, gems. And way down yonder in the pumpkin patch. Where are the gems? Okay. We did some selling already, but we're going to go ahead and sell these, all of them. Let's just sell them. Yeah, sell. That's another 600. Anybody can buy. That's 600. That's pretty good. Yeah, and then the um, now. those um, sapphires are 260 each, and we have eight of them. Uh -huh. Let's just sell them. And it's going to be 2,000. And that's going to give us plenty. Yeah, we Off don't we even go. wear jewelry. I don't know I why. Know. We... Well, you have to see, you have to have gems for certain side ish, side quests and um, armor upgrades. So it does behoove you to, to save them for those items. Um, right. Okay. But we need the money attitude, now, right? and we want to save this. We want to finish the side quest that we started. So oh. we're going to utilize what we have. What would you wear with that mask? I mean, well, you can wear a lot of stuff. I think the flame breaker looks pretty cool with it, actually. Let's just... Play dress up for a second. I would like something red. Yeah, that's that's why. See, the flame breaker looks pretty cool. Oh, but less armory. I know we don't have anything else red right now. I don't. People have an attitude. Oh. Even with armor on. As a matter of fact, we don't even need Majora's mask on right now. I'm kind of kind of like the climber's bandana as the go right. as the go to. Well, Link's a good looking kid, you know. So yeah, he is. You know, you want his face. Yep. Out. All right. So we're going to head back to Hatino and we have everything we need to buy the house. Oh. Oh. And this side quest is called the Hylian Homeowner. <laughs> That's the name of the quest. <laughs> the side quest. <laughs> okay. We're back in Hatino Village and the house, like I said, is right behind the shrine. So it's a quick lefty behind um, outside of that of the shrine in Hatino Village. And across the bridge, and his name is Bolson. And look, they're taking a break. They're just kicking back. Uh -huh. Okay, there's Hudson, Bolson, and Carson. Are you seeing a trend with those three names? Yeah. Carson. It's funny that they are all Bolson, hanging out. Hudson. Hanging out together. They all end in sun. Okay, so we're gonna talk to Bolson. Hey. Yep. 30, wood, uh, 30 bundles of wood. I'll pay your price. Okie doo. I'll grab them from you. And that was a lot of wood. It's like, here's your quart of wood oh, <laughs> and your 3,000 rupees. Why don't you take his money and beat I wish we could, up. like, ne renegotiate. Yeah. Will you take two? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm ready. Seriously? <laughs> you're you're going to give me 3,000 rupees? <laughs> Oh, I'll shell out. Let's do it. No way. 3,000 rupees? I thought you said groupies. <laughs> the guy in the back. 
<laughs> I got a tour bus out there. <laughs> oh, now we only have 1,200 after 4,000. Okay. So now, consider the... Okay, there's a weapons mount. Okay, let's go check out the house. Wow, why, why does this house need a weapons mount? Well, because we own weapons. Okay. Or maybe they had some solicitors. All right, we can go on and go on in the house. Here we go. We gotta get a moat. All right, there's our weapons mount. See oh, it? Is that what That's it is? all that's left in the house, and here's what here's is our the house. weapons mount? Like a closet for weapons? No, well, kind of, actually, kind of, but it's just like you put a weapon up there. Like you're gonna display oh, our weapon. Okay. You can, take you can it. display your weapon. You can display your weapon. I thought they were Okay, so that being life. said, this this light scale trident is pretty cool. You like and that? I think I'm gonna um, Prince Nemo, Princess of, of Atlantis. It's Minda's. <sighs> it's Princess Minda's. Yeah, trident. It's a it's a water weapon. You know, it's a trident, right? From the Zoro region, for sure. Yep, absolutely. I think they got it from what was the name? It's Poseidon. pretty. Poseidon came over and left it. <laughs> and, uh, one of those uh, things okay so we can continue oh wait a minute oh look at look at this guy back here see he has a red explanation point behind his head yeah see he's talking about something that means that's a side quest so he's let's he's have a funny. conversation with him can i talk to you for a minute hey what are you doing he's got a page boy he's taking a break his hair is he, and it's, it's blowing in the wind too yeah He's got the. Hey, by the way, did you buy that house? Mustache. And he said, "Yes, impressive. You're just a pop. Come well. again. Don't worry about it. Anyway, this is a weird conversation. I gotta head out and leave this place soon. Why? He goes, I've been transferred. <coughs> this is getting interesting. Transferred. <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> Might have heard, but Bolson Construction is planning an expansion, big time. Uh, well, that's great. Yeah, big expansion. Where will you go? Zora's domain is north of here. We're going north of that, though, to an area called the Akela region. Mm -hmm. That's pretty far. Bye. Yeah. Well, good luck. Okay, then. Oh, I guess that is the end of it. Well, no time like the present. Should be getting on my way. Oh, if you'd like to come to the Akela region, region and say hello, take care of yourself. It's nice to have a friend. Okay, so here he goes. He's going to go He's get... He's got a satchel. He does have a satchel. Okay, we're on. <laughs> that's going to start um, another side quest. And that side quest is called um, From the Ground Up. And that is going to con be construct. We're going to be on a construction, construction progress to, to, to build Terrytown, which oh. is really fun. Everybody okay. in Terrytown is pretty nice. Huh? Yeah, exactly. Okay, we're going to go up to Carson and buy everything that we need to complete the homeowner's purchase for uh -huh. the Hylian homeowner quest. So let's check him out. Uh -huh. Hi. Need something from me? Yes, we want to build something. And we have three choices that we need to complete all of them. Um, we're going to go ahead and do um, gear displays and get a bow mount. Uh -huh. And it's 100 rupees. And we're going to pay it. And it's up front, so we got to pay it now. And they're gonna go do the work. He's gonna get his guy. Mm. So we're gonna do it itself. Bolsa Constructions, what's our credo with seven colors of paint? Building blooms like the spring. Oh. We get to work. Well, it's really coming along. Take a look if you get a chance. Okay, we will go take an intermittent look right here before we get the rest of the stuff done. We now have a sign. And it says Link's House. Ooh. And inside we now have a... Trident. We do have a trident that we put up. And now we have a bow mount, a couple weapons mount. And I think we have the lighting. Yep, and lighting. Can we get a porch swing? I don't think they have a porch swing. But they do have other um, exterior stuff. All right. We're gonna build something. Um, let's look at the exteriors. We need some flowers, and that's a hundred rupees. That's all they get, yeah. <laughs> all the bells and whistles and extras, huh? All right, here we go with another. Another credo. If you can't pull the saw, then don't push it. 
<laughs> they work so hard. Yeah, they do. They're never. Oh, late look, to it's work. a cutscene. They're never late to work. I bet. I bet they're not. It looks like they live right by the work site. That's Cookie Pot. So. <laughs> All right, so now they're sitting there, and we can go ahead and um, hey. Yes, we do want something from you, Hudson. No, not Hudson. Mm -hmm. His name is Carson. Hudson's the guy that left. Oh, yeah. um, we want our house exterior finished and mm -hmm. some trees. And 100 rupees. We're going to shell out and pay up front. There we are. And here we go. Construction workers, commence. <laughs> Time for construction instruction. Okay. Construction instruction. Jumping jacks. What's our credo? Any nail can fail, so don't let your hammer stammer. Carson. That is hard, you know, nailing nail straight. And finished. All right. And there's the house. It's all done. Trees. Practically perfect. I'm a little credo. jealous. Yeah, they're with their credos. Oh, there we go. You housing monster! What? You got everything! Wow, we're driven. Oh, he threw in some free furniture. It's the oh, least he could do. Carson, oh. look lively. I'm with you. There we go. Carson's his right hand man. Then he is. Yeah. He's like like a foreman or whatever. Or, yeah. Um, oh, he's back. He's like, wait, I thought we were leaving. Give me some water. <laughs> I think they're going to have a break. Okay. And the Hylian homeowner is now complete. Awesome. So here we are at our house with our sign that says Link's house. And let's go check out the inside of our house. What do you think, that guy? I think it's an awful expensive oh, house. Look, now look, we have a, some kitchen. Brand new furniture. And a rug. Oh, and cheese a plate. Yeah, we got a cheese plate. A little. A little fromage. A, cro a cross. Oh, look, yeah. We have Family pictures up now. A desk. We can do our a loft. Oh, we have a night night bed. How trendy. Okay, we have lighting. It's oh. looking pretty good. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I'm so glad that we did this because Asian carpet. all this time I've been um, hanging on to this fire rod and now we can hang it up here because yeah, yeah. I know we need carry it. it around. Yeah, we don't have to carry it around because I know I'm going to need it later on the side quest. But it's not a very good weapon in essence okay what do we have for shields that we want to hang up what are you gonna need the fire rod for for a side quest um a little kid in town goes hey show me some weapons and he goes through the series of weapons and one of them's a fire rod right. he goes, show me the my grandpa told me about a fire rod and you show it to him i think there's five all together and then at the end he gives you a diamond um, from his grandpa so it's kind of cool. cool yeah he's like a music man going to town. <laughs> something like that I'm gonna go ahead and, and put some cool um, weapons up because we're gonna gather some more as we go through. Oh, that's cool with the, with the shield. Um, let me keep those actually. What were we gonna say? Well, I was gonna just had um, deciding which ones to put up. What yeah. else should we put up? Um, maybe. Maybe the Royal Claymar, just because it's cool. Oops. Look at that. That's a cool one. Which one? The Royal Claymar I put up. Oh. And then we can put some bows over here. Uh-huh. Um, just for fun. Uh-huh. And maybe the duplex bow, because that's kind of cool looking bow. We don't have very many bows, so we're only going to put that one up for now. Yeah. When we get up to Rito, we're going to have some really cool bows. We're going right. to get the great eagle bow and stuff. You're going to give me a good cool bow? Yeah, the eagle bow is really oh, cool. That's and this, cool, honey. The swallow bow, the falcon bow, those are all from the Rito region. Yeah. Those are the really cool bows. Yeah, yeah you got to display those. Definitely. And have them in your arsenal. Oh, yeah. You can have two, you yeah, know, for sure. Okay, so... Now, um, if you remember, mm -hmm. the man who was transferred up to the Akela region mm -hmm. when we were 
at making our building our house. Mm -hmm. He is now um, okay. All right. Do you see down below here? When we went down there before, there was nothing there, and mm. now you can see the beginnings of some construction. Well, I tell you. There's a developer in town. Huh? There is a developer in town. It's Bolson Construction. Bolson does not play. <laughs> and you're going to go down here and go check out the construction in progress. And it's Terrytown. Oh. Here he is. <sighs> hey, it's Hudson. We meet again. He's one of Bolson's contractors. Yeah, that's the guy with the page boy. Yeah, cut. remember? He yeah. said he was transferred. Hey, what are you doing here? Uh, he's decided to build a whole village from scratch. Oh, he's bigger than I thought. He looks small. And it's going to be Terrytown. He's a lumberjack? No, he's a construction worker. Oh. He's a house builder. Oh, or, I thought that you know. was an axe. Um, it, it's, a it is axe. a pickaxe, yeah. He's hmm. building. He's and hardcore, so, though. So he needs some help, and we're going to help him out. Cool. So he needs to find people to live there. Mm-hmm. And he needs ten bundles of wood to get started. All right. And we have some wood, so we're just going to go um, get a quick two, two bundles of wood. And bombs are renewable. You never run out of bombs. And there's three pieces of wood right there. I think that does it. Yep, that brings us to 11. I remembered we had eight when we were done Ooh. harvesting for the Harley and homeowner section. And there's your 10 pieces. Yep, we got them. Rancho Cucamonga coming <laughs> so up. Here we go. Next, okay. Those boulders are driving me nuts. We could find someone with huge physical strength to bust them apart. A Goron would be my first choice. Yeah. Good luck. But they it got seems a like union. a long shot. They might. <laughs> oh, uh oh, and one last wrinkle. One last wrinkle. In accordance with the official Bolson construction policy, uh -huh. that someone's name must end, must end in son. If you run by anyone that fits with that set, with what I've said, send them here to Terrytown. Okay, so they're looking for the son. Huh? Yeah, they're looking for. Yeah, all right. So I'm your daddy. <laughs> so we're gonna go up to um, Death Mountain. Well, we're gonna go up to the. Um, Goron City. We're gonna go find some Gorons. It's gonna be hot up there. Find, see if we can find anybody with last, you know, with son at the end. Yay. Yay. Okay, oops, it's really gonna burn up. Yeah, it's hot up there, boy. I need your tank top. Okay, so What's where we need to go is down is that a here. Goron? Oh, no. We need to go down to the southern mine. But there's no easy way there. You have to travel there, you sting the time. Okay, so we have arrived in the um, southern mine region of the Goron area. We had a journey there. Um, there's not a like, really good quick flashpoint to get there, so we're gonna go check out these guys. And who do we have here? We have Django. Hi, Django. Oh, we scared him. <laughs> nope, you won't do. Sorry, we're discriminating. Yeah. Grayson, that'll work. What's your name? My name is Grayson. It ends in sun. Okay. <laughs> to go to work now. If you want to talk to me, come back at night when I'm relaxing. Okay. Okay, okay so good thing we can again, manipulate time and space and we're going to make it nighttime. I just go from break time to break time. <laughs> <laughs> How'd that happen? Okay, so I think he's this guy. Yeah, Grayson. Okay, here we go. Let's talk to him. Yeah. And you are Grayson. I'm a digger here. I dig and dig day Can and night, and he's sick of it. I mean, I have to troll away in obscurity like this. I wish there was a job that could make use of my strength. There is. Huh? No. There is? Yeah. Where? It's in Terrytown. Terrytown? 
Okay. So there's another Bateri's he's there. He's going to tell him all about it. It's in a Kayla region. He goes, huh, Kayla's not too far from here. I'm going to do it while the iron is hot. Oh. Thanks for letting me know. Oh. Pellison and I are going to head there right away. I guess Pellison can go too. Well, I'm at it. Oh. Pellison, we're going to leave. Oh, it's the little guy. Uh -huh. Oh, off they go. <laughs> it's kind of awesome. All right. Cool. Now, our quest has been updated. This one has several steps. Oh, we're up here now. And see how Terrytown is now on the map? Now we're going to go to this shrine and fly down again into Terrytown and check out the um, progress of the town. Yeah. Okay, and we're getting closer into Terrytown. And you can see that there are two, fully two buildings completely up. And... and there's a little store already for me and he's working away let's talk to him oh it's you as you can see i'm working hard and he's his little brother started an ore shop oh look at his ore shop two thousand dollar diamonds no thank you well they are being bridged <laughs> Ben <laughs> Bridge. Oh. And Carson's still working away. Carson, oh. right? Yeah. No, Hudson. <clears throat> oh, Hudson. You sent some Gorons back. That's perfect. It's undeniable strength. Yep. It's rock. Mm. Rock hard. It's dead. Well, next is. So before more people can move here, we need to build more homes, and now he needs 20 bundles of wood. Now get the wood! Yeah, we're gonna have to get some wood. Okay. So, um, we're just gonna grab the resources that are the very closest to us, which are these right here. And... Oh! <laughs> that was pretty funny. Without blowing ourselves up in the meanwhile. Mm -hmm. You need to take it to five to six steps away. One, two, three, four, five, six. You're definitely out of the range of the. Um. And. Oh! <laughs> it is my pleasure. <laughs> I've had Mephis Grace for that one. <laughs> So we're just gonna tear up the landscaping. Yeah. <laughs> Tearing up. Yep. Boom! Hey, you just took the tree out of the new shopping center. <laughs> right. You just planted that one. Right. Yeah, right. Yeah. They'll grow back, I promise you. That's what you say to all everybody. <laughs> uh, tearing up people's stuff. Dude, we've never had a we've only had a stump here since 1972. <laughs> they said it would grow back. <laughs> well, they never do. They never do. Okay, let's see where we're at with wood. Oh, we only have ten. Oh yeah, we're halfway there. We need to go to a heavily forested area. Like maybe the Great Plateau. There's some good little wooded... Oh, the trees aren't so isolated. Right. Man, you need a forestation. <laughs> or the runoff goes. This one at a time is kind of... for the birds. This is the, the, the bombs are... To, the bombs are endless, you know, unlimited bombs. Keep the bombs coming, honey. And then Dow bomb it out.
Oh, check it out. Oh. Okay. Oh, side note. Korok seed, when you see a yellow flower. That's a Korok? Always. Oh. Oh, but it's not going to be easy. Oh, it's out there on the limb, that last one? <laughs> Better not start raining. Oh, my goodness. You don't have to climb anything. Yeah, you do. It's Where is it? Sheer foot. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. What the what the heck? That's it, but oh do I have enough stamina to get up? Oh no. Yep, you gotta have a stamina. Oh see? The red ones. I always think the hardest ones are are those dark red purpley guys. That's your color, isn't it? Well it is well I like that color, but I always see every time one of those pops up it's like one that was kinda like tricky or more difficult or harder to access. Um, harder level C to find. Right. Now you just watch this run through. You see if I, my theory's correct or not. Okay. Usually it is. <laughs> because it's already tested before you tell me. Oh, not, well, I, I, well, the theory's, the, the jury's out. The, so there's no, there's no scientific evidence yet. <laughs> okay, we have the 20 wood. We've gathered a 20. And now we're going back to talk to Hudson. I kept getting his name and calling him Carson. That wasn't right. Carson was the other worker. So now we're going Carson's back to... Carson's more respectable. <laughs> Carson was like his uh, worker guy. Yeah. And here, here we go. Hudson. And oh. Hudson. Hey. Nice hairdo. We did bring you... The, I know he does have some a bomb hairdo. <laughs> um, <laughs> we should do like top ten hairdos in the one high rule. <laughs> Yeah, it's like uh, when you go to the barber, all the hairdos are exactly the same. <laughs> the, yes. Ricky says, long, that would be hilarious. Okay. Um, tailoring, a gift for tailoring. Oh, okay, Talking about tailoring. Afterwards. Oh, look at this. She, He's saying tailoring would be um, Gerudo. Gerudo. Okay. Don't forget, it has to say sun. Okay. Oh. I think I know where we met him. Somebody who's into tailoring in Ooh. the in the Gerudo region, Ooh. in the um, Kara Kara Bazaar. Oh yeah. Okay, we know just the person. Man, you got contacts, don't We've you? We've got contacts. I mean, you know everybody. All right, here we go. Now we're gonna take our flight to the desert. Which is about as far as you can get uh -huh. from Michaela, actually. Right. We're going to travel over there, and then we're going to go to the Kara Kara Bazaar. See if okay, so we're in the desert now. And you know what? We don't even need to go in. We don't even need to put on our Gerudo outfit because we're not going in town. Um, uh But we do want one of these guys. Oh, we need a shield. Shield it up. Shield it up. Where's my shield? Here we go. Hmm. Because we're going to dash over to the Kara Kara Bazaar. Okay. It's quicker. There's no, there's no like, uh, warp point. Mm-hmm. So it's, cool. we can just hit the thing seal. Yeah, it's like Uber for desert. <laughs> it's like the desert Uber. Uber, that was funny. <laughs> but we're still wearing our flame breaker outfit unnecessarily. So we can change into our Hylian gear. Yeah. Okay. And here we are. Let's see if we can find somebody. Let's find the seamstress. I know there is one. Where is she? Here she is. She's just sitting there. Bored. Rondson. Her name is Rondon. Ronson. That means her daddy's name is Ron. Bravo. I bet, Mama, I would have a problem 
with a delicate bow like you. Hail from Gerudo Town. The search for the love of my life. She's like, I don't know why I'm even saying this. It's the rush. That's a bizarre combination. I've proven myself to be a gifted tailor. Mm -hmm. She's looking for her She's lover. looking for her husband, yeah. Yeah. You said go to Terrytown. Oh, what is it? So abrupt. Let me hear the details. Ooh. Well, she's, he, oh, he's kicking it down. He's telling her all about it. You see that? Yeah. Are you watching? Yeah. Huh. A tailor? They need one in Akela? Oh, is kind oh. of far. She's going to go. Yes, you. Yes. Thanks everybody, for the information. Everybody likes friends. I'm gonna pack a huge bag and some lunch. Yep. She yeah. outski. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Two souls in the desert, one in high heels, no less. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, being back to Terrytown and seeing the pro progress of the village, mm -hmm. and here we go. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Another building has been constructed and it looks like they have improved the square mm, got some high rise condos <laughs> and we're still looking for Rancho Cucamonga um, I wonder if they have sauna and workout Hudson. room oh look at she's got her little outfit store up and running Ooh. and we don't have any money because we spent it all well, at least we have friends. Well, we have a house now. We ha we own a home now. Oh, you gotta have okay. Friends. Hey, what are you doing? We here? found someone from Gerudo, and she's making outfits. And her name is Ronson. Check out her clothing shop. Mm -hmm. Well, next is we need more homes. Now we need thirty bundles of wood. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, as you can see, Terrytown is well underway. Urban becoming, renewal. Uh, becoming an urban renewal project. Hey. So, we're going to continue um, the continuation of Terrytown on our next episode. Mm -hmm. So, stay tuned for that. And join us again. Thanks to all the subscribers and everyone who's been giving us likes. We really appreciate it. And we'll see you next time on The Zelda Lady. Bye now. Bye. <laughs>